Make sure you stay until the end, we will explain about common mistake people make when replacing fuses and that can cost you quite a bit of money. Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you having a BMW 4 Series Generation F32, F33, F36 if you guys have one of those. Uh, this is the 4 Series BMW from year 2013 to 20, uh, 2020 and if you have no sound coming from the speakers, stay with us, we'll explain which fuses you need to check. You may need to check up to 10 different sound fuses. We will explain where they are located, where you can buy cheap fuses, parts, tools, the good price, quick shipping, that way you do not waste your money when why it's important to test fuses and relays. All that will be covered absolutely free for your convenience, make sure you stand till the end. Now, even though we have a BMW 3 Series here at the garage, 3 and 4 Series BMWs are built on the same platform. Many of the things will be really close or about the same, but specifically we will explain about BMW 4 Series in this video today. Before we start guys, let me tell you a little bit about us. If you guys need to find fuses, relays for that BMW 4 Series generation from 2013 to 2019, we'll make video for every single fuse relay. Why? Because let's say you're in the middle of nowhere, you need to find where the fuel injector or fuel pump fuse is located. You have multiple hidden fuses, you can find and replace it, get back on the road guys, fix that problem because otherwise, okay, you'll be stuck in the middle of nowhere. Every single car we get here at the garage guys, we take them completely apart we show you how to fix pretty much anything from transmissions, engines, bodywork guys all that will be on our channels check it out let me show you where you can find more about it right here we have more than 10,000 free repair videos that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs and if you need to buy parts, tools, fuses for your BMW or any car at a really good price quick shipping that way you do not waste your money we'll share the link in the description of the video below where you can get it from so let's start on it now so what do we have here now specifically 2015 BMW guys for series fun fact about that car you have guys up to uh, six different fuse boxes most people know about two or three but you have up to six uh, now where they're located we have a special video about that today we're working two of them the first one is under the hood open the hood guys right in front of the windshield on the passenger side and behind the shock tower you have one trim cover remove it you get to a fuse box once you open the cover right here you're going to see a fuse box layout like this one before we continue let's explain quickly why it's important to test fuses and relays it is guys very important to test fuses and relays on those fuses you cannot clearly see if they're burnt or not especially you can see in the jk's fuses as well and if you guys assume okay let's say you remove a fuse you look at it and you assume guys that it's a, actually a, a good fuse but it's actually a bad fuse sometimes you cannot clearly see that what can easily happen guys at that point uh, you can uh, uh, put the bad fuse in and you start replacing parts and tools that you don't need to so you lose your time you lose your money to fix a problem that doesn't exist when all we had to do is test the fuse and replace it we'll put a link to a special video that will teach you how to test fuses how to check relays very easily as well guys so uh, check it out it will be in the description of the video below what we have here specifically, this is towards the windshield side, the front of the BMW, passenger side, driver side. Here we need to check one fuse, starting on this side, even if you have a missing fuse, you count the spot, you start with fuse 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Fuse number 25 will need to be checked right here, after that guys, okay, uh, you need to open the trunk under the cargo liner here, right under the cargo liner, if you pull it out where that arrow is, you have the main trunk fuse box that looks like this one. Here we'll need to check multiple, multiple fuses. We're going to start with fuse number 120, 121, 122, 123. These four fuses here will need to be checked. After that guys, okay, uh, you will need to you will need to go to find fuse number 125 right there 126 128 right there the last uh, no, not the last you still have more the another fuse that you need to check the last in that row is 142 right here then you need to check 147 that 5 m fuse here and you need to check fuse number 155 that second 15 amp fuse and 159 hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching see you guys next time